Hi, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Dragoon Part 6. And in between, I was doing a bit of farming for the additions. And that went quite well. We have... Dart is maxed on all. Harpoon and Spinner Cane are maxed, and I did a couple extra on Rod Typhoon just to try and get the timing, but I'm still not very good at it, I must admit. So we are here. So let's move on. The way I farm is I load up a TV series and then I farm while watching. And with this game that's particularly difficult because I, I'm required to focus. And I, I'm not very good at that as you've seen. So no new enemies there. And what do we have here? A healing potion. And here. 50 gold. Can't go wrong there. So we are back on the world map. That's got to be Bale over there. Okay, so new enemy. Wow. Okay, that did a lot of damage. It is called Yellow Bird. Very inventive. Ah, it's really hard to get the one after the circle because there's a slight bit of hesitation that really ruins my timing. Oh, that did not do a lot of damage, did it? Okay. Yes. Missed! No! What an evil little piece of something I shall not say. Anyway, let's head into Bale. Oh, yeah, there we go. In Devil's Castle, capital Bale. Okay, I should mention that I actually have a cold right now, but I'm using a crap load of um, nasal spray to stop myself from sounding so bunked up. Steal from them. What do we have here? Isn't that a little too handsome? Thank you. I'll treasure this. So, let's have a look. So, look, shall we? So that is in, in neither. Where are you? There we go. Okay, have no idea what that does. Cannot get up there. Have a little look around. There has to be something in here. I'm a little bit confused. I'm tapping away, hoping to find something that... You'd think there'd be something, right? Hmm, never mind. I'm looking forward to getting to the vendor that sells gear. 
Just damn that yellow bird did a lot of damage. So let's go down. Ah, uh, drinks, drinks. Give, give me more drinks. Okay. We have an alcoholic. You'll notice I'm not doing the voice for every character I speak to. That's because uh, I can't think of what voice to give them. So we have a save point. This is clearly some sort of in. Well, there we go. Buy one of those, we give that to the alcoholic. And what do we have here? Okay. So, we have a spirit to give to the uh, alcoholic. Now this looks like my sort of sh uh, store. What do we have? Well, first off, we're going to sell um, our poison guard. And all three bracelets. I'm not sure if you saw in the last part. I actually got a poison guard from an enemy. And we'll sell you. And I will buy. Hmm. Actually, let's just have another quick look at that. Okay, I was seeing if there was an armed selection. Damn. There's the door. Really wanted some new weapons and stuff. Put a story there. Another way. Let's uh, talk to this guy. Oh, you're gonna give me spirits? Brother, you're generous. Well, I'll have it. Now, there has to be something in here worth the 100 gold. Okay, so this looks fun. There's an item here. So, as I said in the first part, I'm basically playing blind. So this is two X's. Because I played this when I was a lot younger, and I haven't played it since. And I just remember it being a good game. I don't remember any of the secrets. Where the hell am I? I'm down here. And yeah, I'm not using a walkthrough or anything like that. And I don't ever intend to. So I just wanted to make that clear. Okay, so there's a boat down there. We'll explore that at some point, but for now, let's get back to the main room. So yeah, this part will mostly be me exploring the town, unfortunately, for you guys. But that's what happens in RPGs. This will probably be the only RPG I do for a long time. Okay, so we were down there. There's a nice little door here. Hmm. 
Nothing in here. Just trying to familiarise myself with uh, this area too. Okay, so we can't get there. Run! What do we have over here? We have another way. Let's do all the doors in this one first then. Okay, I don't think we need to speak to all these people, so I won't. Now, this looks like a weapon store. Speak to... there we go. Okay, so this tells you who they're for, and the increases to them. Okay, so... Um, we have Poison Guard on Shana and on Dart, so we don't really want this. Uh, although, it should... I'm pretty sure Labitz is already wearing that. I think he's wearing Salad as well. But we will buy one for Dart. Leather jacket. I think we'll buy one. Yeah, because now I'm not seeing any increase. And a bastard sword and a sparkle arrow. We'll buy one of those each. His attack goes from 2 to 7. That's going to make him pretty damn good. So, let's have a quick look at that. Yeah, he's wearing the scale armor and salad. And now the bastard sword. So his attack is pretty good now. I'm going to sell those items because they will annoy me otherwise. So let's do that. Actually, I don't think I can. No, nope, I have to sell them at a different vendor. So, never mind. What do we have here? Okay, that looks like Indel's Castle to me. That's the last place we want to check. We have some time, so... There probably will not be any cutting in this episode. Other than the first battle I encountered. That's interesting. The healing light. Okay. Well, there's this room here, and then we'll do the other room. Okay, I didn't see what side I was going to come out on there. Okay! So I don't need to be there then. That's pretty cool. And, yeah, it's a huge place that doesn't really have much to offer, really. You just have to run around and figure all that out. So, yeah, this is not the most interesting part for you guys, but hopefully you'll enjoy it anyway. Because we will be like this every time we get to a new town.
Anything up here? Um, there is something actually. Stardust. We have, um, okay, this just gives us some information about the areas. We have a section for Stardust. I still don't remember what that does. I know it's important. But what does it do? I just cannot remember. But we will cross that bridge when we get to it. And speaking of crossing bridges. And I believe there was a way over here. Okay, we have three ways to go here. Ah, yeah. uh, we get horses here later on, I think. Wait, is that something? No. I'll visit my home after I finish briefing King Albert. I have to draw a line as a knight. Whatever you say. Okay, so this is where Lavitz lives. Wonder if we'll see that family there. Is there anything in here? Hmm. We get to grant wishes. How about hmm, invincibility? Not immortality, just invincibility. Okay. We'll go see that boat. And then we'll go to King Albert. How can we open this? Okay, I should have clicked that earlier. If you have any advice on how to do these parts, where there's no action, just exploration, I will gladly listen. This is my first RPG and I don't often watch RPGs because, well, I much prefer playing them. And we have something here. Sparkle Arrow. I just bought one of those. God damn it. Oh, that's a dummy. <laughs> well, that's a person. Looks like there's something over here. And here we have two ladders. And they probably lead down to where the boat is. Now I just have to figure out how to get into them. That'll happen. Oh, there's one right there. But first I want to make sure this leads to the outside. Just need to check. It does. Ah, there is another side though, so we will do that first. Clearly I'm an idiot. I didn't see that exit while I was in there. Come on, Dart. And we have an item over here. Don't be a bastard sword. 50 gold. I can live with that. I really like the graphics on this game, they're very, very nice. A ladder over there. And can we get through here? Nope, so I have to find a way into that room. There is an arrow though. That must be at the top of the ladder. Okay, so we will... Come on, out of the way. A lot of people getting in my way. 
is an arrow here. I don't see why. It should take us down by the boat. Yeah, see this wheel? There we go. And then there's a ladder over there that takes us to the boat as well. Which I presume is the other ladder on this map here. Now where is the king? Is this the king? Doubt it. Am I being stupid? Oh, clearly I've got to go up there. That makes total sense. I am the head of the first knighthood. Lavit slambered. I am back from the field. Oh, Lavitz. I was feeling uneasy because I heard you were missing. Oh, please. Make yourself comfortable, everyone. Your Majesty, it's more than I deserve. Ha 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 ha. It was true. His Majesty was so dismayed that he couldn't see to his affairs of state. Oh, Noish. Please don't tease me. Lavitz is a friend from my childhood, as well as a master of martial arts. Anyway, where have you been? After my first knighthood was wiped out, I was captured by Sandora and held against my will in Helena prison. What? In Helena? However, thanks to the act of this young man, I managed to break out. Let me introduce these people to you. Dart and Shana. They are from Sellers. I thank you for saving Lavitz. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. In gratitude for this. Tell me if you need anything. I have a favor to ask. Is it possible to take care of Shana in this castle? What? It seems Imperial Sandora attacked Celes to take Shana away so they could go so they could go after Shana any time. And when I think of it Is that the reason you brought me here? Shana I can walk next to Dart. I've been working towards that. There's nothing we can do about the time we were apart. But I want to be with you forever. Unfortunately, you cannot leave her here. Imperial Sandora obtained the force called Dragon and went on the offensive. We are holding the battle line in Hawks, but if the Dragon can fly at low altitudes and directly attack the castle, we cannot defend it even with the high ramparts. There is no place safe in Sergio now. Besides, you do know how she feels about you, don't you? Jana, it may be even more dangerous from now on. I don't mind, as long as I can be with you, Dart. Well, I take back the request, but one more thing I would like to ask a question. To Minister Noish. Ask me anything, son. My head is filled with all the legends and history of the continent of Endinus. I was on a journey to pursue the black monster. The black monster? The monster that attacked Neat 18 years ago. The only thing that I know is that he deprived me of my parents and my hometown. Huh, you are a victim of the devil? I want to hear everything. Please tell me about it. Hmm, there's hardly any information left. Everything that was related to him was reduced to ashes. The only thing that I know is, the Black Monster is called the Devil that disobeyed the Great Existence. And it is also known for devouring the God. Devouring the God? Yes, and surprisingly it shows up in history beginning 11,000 years ago. Eleven thousand years ago is the time the Dragon Campaign ended. Yes, exactly right. Your Majesty, 
Instead, I will tell you the story of the Dragon Campaign. As if they were gods, Winglies ruled over all living creatures and used them as slaves. The enslaved suffered a terrible domination and injustice. Their anger turned to a flame of fury. Then a gust of wind blew throughout the lands, spreading the flame to a blazing fire. The wind was Emperor Diaz. Seven incarnations of dragons served the Emperor. Their bravery inspired people to take up arms. Thus began the Dragon Campaign. It was a harsh war. Both people and Winglies suffered countless injuries and fatalities. After a long period of suffering, it was the humans who acquired the future. The age of humans had begun. Black Monster appeared after the Dragon Campaign. Excuse me, sir. It's time for the war meeting. I see. Tell them we will come soon. That, Shana, the war will be particularly harsh for. One for those who no longer have a home to return to. The castle is very quiet now. It is best to think about your future. But this is our first time in a castle. Well, there is a place with a great view next to this room. Go enjoy yourself. A view from the castle? I see. Please excuse me. She is so hasty. Please excuse me too. Okay, so I'm going to end this part here. Thank you very much for watching. I know it's very long. I'm having a hard time making these a lot shorter than uh, the amount of time they're taking. But I really will try to make them shorter than this in the future. I will see you in the next part. Thanks for watching.